Recently, a certain sickness has been going around. I stumbled upon this graphic by the Washington Post that uses a dot model to replicate the spread of the virus, and I wanted to make something a little bit more advanced in C. To start off, I made the dots, but the dots couldn't do anything. Using a structure called dot, I assigned all the properties, including speed, direction, and color. But these dots were pretty hard to control. I realized that I could assign each dot a spot in an array. Then I could update the position by calling them from the array. Every loop checks if the dots have collided. And if the dots collide with a sick person, they too get sick. Well, this works fine. But in the real world, not everyone survives. When the dots are infected, I will determine their chance of death, like God himself. And when they die, I'll update their stats and change their color to black for a few seconds. What a beauty. Thank you for watching today's video. If you enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more coding content. This program has so much potential, so I'd love to hear your suggestions in the comment section down below. As always, the source code is linked in the description. It's everyday code for everyday people. And I'll see you in the next video.